Happy Tuesday everyone. We asked for it finally. A few showers out there. We have a better chance coming up a little bit later in the week. Something we really, really need already in fire season really throughout the area and drought declarations for many of the counties watching right now. Cooler, cloudier days really over the next about four, five, six days. We do start to warm up next week, but scattered showers and thunderstorms possible on Wednesday with the thunderstorms. Looks like a decent amount of precipitation possible as well. So we should be for the most part avoiding any new fire starts due to those lightning strikes. We will keep an eye on it though, especially as we get into Thursday. Thursday looking more on the dry side, but then another round of rain possible on Friday. That's probably our best chance of widespread rainfall throughout the area. As we get into Wednesday, a few chances out there. We'll call it scattered. Get into Friday, more of us seeing that rain and some of that rain actually sticking around for a couple of minutes. Warmer with a few showers over the weekend, but then we do start to dry out as we get into next week. As we look at the coast tonight though, this is one area that's actually more on the drier side. Usually this time of year systems come through, they stick to the coast and then dry out as they go further inland. The orientation with this next one and the one we're seeing on Friday, mainly a little further inland. And that's good news because we need more rainfall further inland. The coast could use a bit as well. So a slight chance of showers becoming cloudy tomorrow and more showers as you go throughout the day. Temperatures in the 50s and 60s tomorrow afternoon. For the West Valleys, a bit more active here. Just a few showers for the coast, more widespread shower activity, especially on the west side of the Cascades. Mostly cloudy tonight, slight chance of showers, and slight chance of storms. That builds up more tomorrow. We'll call it scattered showers with a few isolated thunderstorms possible. Heading into the afternoon, temperatures 5 to 10 to 15 degrees below average, 68 degrees for Medford, where usually you're closer to 80 degrees this time of year. And east of the Cascades, partly to mostly cloudy. Now tonight, if the clouds stick around, a lot of areas should avoid freezing temperatures, but the potential is there. Shemolt, Christmas Valley, further north you go. Also, a few chances of storms. Already a few strikes of lightning as you get into northern Klamath and Lake County becoming cloudy tomorrow. A better chance of showers and thunderstorms by the afternoon. Temperatures in the 50s and 60s tomorrow afternoon. Your seven day forecast, especially active on Friday. A few of those showers might hang around till about Saturday. Bye bye the afternoon Saturday and Sunday. We are looking at warmer, sunnier conditions. Just a chance of showers cooling us down slightly towards Monday for the Klamath Basin. Showers and chance of thunderstorms trending more towards just showers for your Friday. That'll continue through the weekend before drying out Saturday and Sunday. Slight chance on Monday, but should stay mostly dry there as well. Just a little bit cooler. Northern California showers and a chance of thunderstorms for your Wednesday. Showers are likely on Friday. Just a slight chance on Saturday and Monday of next week. And out on the coast, cooler, cloudier weather and rain fairly likely on Friday and Saturday. Chance of showers continues into Sunday and Monday of next week.